Listen up, the friendly band take a member, let's see y'all Start it back in all these girls Fuck this big bag Listen up, the friendly band take a man Work them back, party back and all you bitches Fuck I really haven't been vlogging this week also last week's vlog was supposed to be uploaded the week before I think I have like a burnout or something like that because I haven't really been consistent no matter how hard I try I can't keep myself or I can't put myself to just add the vlogs and just post every week so yeah I'm really sorry for that um, but right now I'm sitting, I'm waiting on my tram because I'm heading to a business conference and yeah, I really want to, you know, get all the tips that's needed for Tiara because, you know, a businesswoman, it's always really good to just feed in yourself and know from the bigger ones that has been doing it or been in the game already for a long time. So, yeah. Um, also in the beginning of December I have another one that also I want to attempt or I just got my ticket to it but it's online so I will feed y'all in also on that one the one of the day I don't know how it's going to unfold so I'll try to get like a few clips here and there but I'm not gonna promise anything but yeah I also got really fast out of house so I didn't really show y'all my outfit but it's very simple sneakers my pantalons my coat and this like but um how do you call that or oh, here's my tram y'all wait <laughs> because i ain't gonna miss it we'll talk later Today I'm alone and my first client is in like how late it is in like 12 minutes I have my first client I also have like a big gap like a one hour gap I'm going to use that as my um, free time maybe do a little bit of chit chat here and there because there's a little a few things that I want to say here and there or talk about as you can hear by my voice I'm a little bit sick um, my nose is almost all the way yeah closed oh my gosh this thing ain't gonna fit me because it's extra small and we don't have a small or medium which fits me so I'm going to wear it like this for today oh my gosh I also have like this fan so I can keep myself warm because yeah I think I got like a flu or something I still can handle it though I came prepared but in my break I'm going to show y'all what all the things that I bought with me to keep myself you know strong during the day 
it's not even a like a long day um i think around five i'm already done for the day and right now it's um something before 12. so it's not even a long day so i can pull through and i also pray for god to give me the strength to pull through because i didn't want to disappoint my clients and yeah starting from now i will be working every saturday also i work twice a week i also run my business so Tiora, as you already know i'm influencing like y'all you know, there's a bunch of things happening all at once but i'm enjoying the ride um i also got myself a frappuccino the grab grab and go frappuccino of starbucks in the caramel flavor they also had cookie and cream but i didn't want that one so i got myself like this one and yeah that's that for now what else did i bought i also came with my laptop i will have to get a new cover for my laptop because the one that i have previously um broke um this time i want to get like a beige but i don't know for sure because it's a color that can get dirty really fast so I'm still hesitant about that one but we're trying to figure that out and yeah maybe I should show y'all like the room a little bit or the space that I'm or yeah the vibe here if you came here already or if you're a client you know this is the vibe super cozy and I was sitting right there and here you can go to the rooms so oh, and a big mirror doesn't disappoint this is the outfit of the day though it's really really cold outside oh i'm gonna uh, have to put on my crocs let me do that and i will show you like the whole outfit okay so this is the complete outfit super cute i have on this legging this velvet plush legging by primark it has like this here inside so it keeps you very warm with my high knee socks or knee it's not even a, it's just like high socks <laughs> to keep my foot warm um this turtleneck long sleeve blouse is also by primark and with of course a jacket of l clinics and for the hair very simple and comfortable for the day so yeah it's ready to start the day okay quick seven minutes <laughs> before my client comes oh this thing is so warm i love it um i'm going to light a new candle so we can put in the waiting room is the pink apple punch these candles by bad and body works are really really good um so yeah i legit hate these kind of lighters <laughs> i can just burn my hands with these look at my nail it's so hot oh my god i think i burnt myself oh my god but i have to legit let these like we need to get like new layers yeah i'm gonna try again it doesn't want to be late such a bitch Okay, Woo! even though I burned my fingers, but yeah, let's put these. Right about here. So I'm done with my first two clients. Um, right now I have like a big gap, a one hour break or like it's just a gap. And I received like two missed calls, so I'm just going to call back and see. Hello, alle clinics is break met Asia. Ik had een gemiste oproep gekregen. Momentje. 
Nee, ze zit al vol op het 24ste. Oké, okay, is goed hoor. Doei doei. Fijne dag. Oké, okay, this one doesn't pick up. So we're just going to wait and see if they call back. But yeah, that's what I do on a daily basis here. I also have my clients. I do laser hair removal. And the benefits of it is really, really good. I do it myself. If you follow me on Insta, you should know this by now. I do laser hair removal for a few months already. I started first off with um, Brazilian and my armpits. Right now I'm doing almost my full body. I also have like my, um, I do the, my upper lip, um, <clears throat> also my legs and also my chin. So yeah, I do a lot because I do have PCOS and I get like a few hairs here and there on my chin and my upper lip also especially in the corner um yeah it's not nice it's not nice i have a mustache y'all and i hate my mustache so we have to get rid of that um as i'm here talking to y'all i'm just going to show y'all what i bought with me so i can survive the day i've been praying since the morning god help me help me help me and it's going really really good um, but I'm just going to show you what I got or what I brought at work with me today. First of all, of course, I showed you the Starbucks. Still didn't get a chance to drink it. A bottle of water. Um, my boss is so, so nice. She got us this vitamin C thousand immune system capsule so we can take um, to maintain like our immune on level to be honest i only took it once so if she hears that i'm a little bit sick she's going to be a little bit mad not really really mad but she's like why did i bought those things for y'all but she's really really nice y'all let me get like the rest of the things so i can show y'all what else i bought <laughs> to survive the day also i got myself a ham and cheese croissant and also a lumpia baroque i think you call it like that I also got my yellow ginger shot because we have to keep the immune on level even though I'm already a bit sick but we're trying here you know I have to do my wait a minute hello can you speak with a shower me can you help her hello ah gewoon scheren ja ja okay doe doei yes this is one of my clients that i have at the end of the day um i also got i also brought the inhalation capsules these ones you get them at kruidvat you put them in a hot water bed and it's just open your sinus really really good i love it i put only like two to three in a bowl with hot water and y'all it literally just refreshing up my whole whole studio which is really really good i only put it in the kitchen and my whole studio will be smelling like minty like it's very 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 intense um with that i also got the china first um capsules for my immune system um my mom gave this to me and also this one <laughs> um my mom gave me one and also a friend of mine gave me a new one because I couldn't find it like just besides my house, so the Cried Fat in Centrum. So uh, yeah, I was running out and a friend gave me like a new one. Very, very nice. And also I got, what's the name of this? Diclofena Natrium Retard. <laughs> yeah, I can't spell these shit for nothing. But this one, it legit helps me to go during the day. Um, especially if I have like headaches, if you have your period and you have heavy cramps, this is your friend. I swear this is your friend. So it's better than paracetamol because paracetamol doesn't even work with me. Um, it's either this one or ibuprofen, and that's it. Only those two. But further than that, like paracetamol, it doesn't do nothing. <laughs> it doesn't do nothing for me. 
um i don't know if you can get it here in holland never been to a drugstore here in holland to be honest um other than kruidvat and ethos but i didn't see that they have this one in those stores i have like three full um packs of these at home because every time that i go to curacao or i have somebody that i know either my mom or a family member that goes to curacao i let them bring a new box of these for me because it's a must to have in the house so i got all those things y'all all those things to survive the day and also really really kind of my boss she also have mandarins in the fridge for us and even ice cream how good how good is that but i'm not going to eat ice cream i think i'm just going to take one of those mandarins so i can get all the necessary vitamins that i need and yeah that was it the other thing that i wanted to talk a little bit about is the fact that yesterday i showed on my instagram page um a dm that i got a yeah i got a message in my inbox on instagram saying that you need to um you need to get rid of your hair and gave me them because they are my ultimate dream which this person wanted to compliment me on this but that was so rude of a compliment so i gave them back a lesson and i saw that there was like different kind of opinions based on that and some people literally saw that okay maybe they tried to compliment you but it didn't go as well they could have said it another way which i totally get with my hair like i have so many person that legit love my hair and i know that because i get complimented about them often they love my throat they love my curls they love everything about my hair which is legit my crown and i carry it with so much pride for you to come say such things um <clears throat> but there was this person um if you're watching this i don't want you to take it personal but i think everybody has their own opinion and this person kind of attacked me and said you know that they meant to say it like a compliment you didn't have to do that extra y'all i'm nice i'm legit a nice person but if you test me i'ma give it to you back okay so i approached back with a very calm and sincere reply to that message and she legit understand my point of view but y'all one thing about me i'ma be nice but if you if i have to give you back what i have to give you i'ma say it and those type of comments you cannot do it i will take it very personal for me it's like a i can legit compare it to a racist comment i don't want to even go that way but i can legit pair it with that it's giving me pretty much bad vibes and envy and one thing about me i'm very spiritual and um being spiritual means that i catch up on vibrations very fast so when i read this message my spirit wasn't at place it was troubled asap i was here at work i was working and i just had to take like a minute of break zen out and pray over this because it had a massive quick um what do you call that um effect on my spirit and when something doesn't feel good y'all yeah, I'ma, I'ma act on it i'ma act on it like very quick okay so me and this person hashed things out and i corrected them they saw that okay yeah i'm in the wrong for saying that there i could have said it in another way i just really love your hair but I learned from this so i want you to share it also on your story they give me permission for me to share it on my story um so we can educate other people on these type of things and especially giving these type of compliments you know to watch out for your words or the way that you say it so there's no bad blood between me and this person at all and we close that chapter but one thing i want to make clear is if one thing doesn't sit right within my spirit 
I'm gonna act upon it. I ain't gonna shut my mouth and let everybody walk upon me because I'm a public figure. No, I'm gonna say something about it because these type of things need to stop. These type of things need to be corrected. And if you don't take your time and correct somebody based on those type of behaviors, they are going to keep doing the same to other people or with yourself. That's really what I wanted to say. For me, it's a closed chapter. Um, I also got so many sweet messages. Every, um, especially, I got a lot of messages. People saying like, no, this is not okay. I feel like this is such an envy. This is my girl. Oh, for like, y'all, yeah, the... DMs that I got were more like, yeah, I couldn't take it myself either because it's giving me pretty much the bad energy. So I'm glad that I'm not the only person that saw it like that. But I can legit see the other side of the road and see like, okay, they really didn't meant it, okay? But that's all. And I'm just going to enjoy the rest of my break. If there's something's going to come up, I'm going to catch y'all in the details. But I just wanted to chill for this, you know, in this one hour break. Because, yeah, my body is not that good, 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 good. So maybe I'm just going to take a quick nap. And like 15 to 10 minutes before my next um, client, I'm going to just get things ready, refresh my face, and get it running. Later than that, as I'm seeing right now, I also have like a... 30 minutes break so maybe we can do a chit chat with that within that minute i don't know i'm gonna just eat my croissants 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 am i the only one that doesn't love my croissants when it's cold but in this case i can heat it up we do have a microwave but Oh shit. <laughs> mm -mm. Okay. Let me. I'm going to grab a mug, put some hot water in it, and put one of these capsules in it so I can. I got my sinus going. I'm back. I'm feeling that I'm getting worse minute by minute. And I still have three clients. <laughs> In seven minutes, I have a next client. Um, I feel like dying. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to give up. My body is not giving slowly getting up lord just a little bit more please like one hour and i'm done just one hour i also recalled when i finished the first footage so the one before this one that i didn't really say like how the lasering treatment is going it's going really really great um for my armpits, I barely have any hair anymore. Um, I can almost say that I don't have hair anymore. I only got like two to three here and there and that's it. For my Brazilian area, I still have like a few hair hairs here and there. So I think a few sessions is needed. Um, what else my legs i only have two appointments by far and i'm always already seeing like massive change i barely have hair um what else do i do my upper lip i still see here but it's going to take a little bit of time and i also do like around my belly button area because i have like my hair grow up just to my belly button so i also layer laser that part which i still have a few hairs here and there but i didn't even take like too much sessions i think five for the brazilian the armpits and my belly button area and 
yeah massive change so yeah y'all i'm trying mom i'm dying <laughs> okay there's like 40 minutes left i don't i think my client is going to be precisely on time or five minutes late we're gonna see oh let me just add another thing in the system i'm done for the day i'm just getting everything ready so i can head home finally god gave me the strength to survive the day and i love it god came in like a clutch <laughs> always always oops i feel when i get home i'll just have to eat and then call it a day tomorrow is going to be my um chill day yes i'm not ready for the cold weather outside i was super chill oh my gosh in here super super chill Only those lights turn this one off wait let me check to see how late my tram is going to come because i'm not going to stay outside in that cold really ghetto Woo. let me take up this also because yesterday oh i was in the train and i really really had to um had to pee and y'all i was like no god i can't hold it anymore i can't hold it i hold it finally but i felt immediately that my body was taking all of the necessary energy for me to hold it so when i finally got home i was like oh my god <laughs> finally my energy drained really fast but yeah let me get to the going to go to get, um, take a piss and I'm gonna check my tram okay also I'm in Stradivarius I'm doing just a little bit of shopping not too much but I love this jacket I love this top it's I have to crop right now but it's a full top so you can cover your belly or you can tuck it in your pants if you, if you want but there's like these trending trousers mm, i don't know how i feel about them but yeah i don't know even the back is not really giving i don't know if i'll be part of this trend how i've tried i don't know it doesn't sit right with me to be honest but the fit is cute the fit is cute with the jacket. The jacket is so freaking cute. Look at the back. Amazing. I love it. Let me check the price. It's how much? 70 euros. I don't know if I'll pay 70 euros for it, but it's cute. And also, I grabbed the same trouser in the like this dark gray, but I'm not going to fit it this full jumpsuit and also this skirt i'm going to try this whole fit with the skirt right now I realized that I wear more pants, giants, and those type of things instead of skirts and dresses, which I don't know why. So I'm trying to change it up a little bit and add a little bit more skirt and dress in my wardrobe. And this is so freaking cute. It's like a going out outfit and I so I can wear the skirt like on a basis. Cute, 
right? Wait for y'all to see the silk dress that I tried on. I'm going to try it on again because I um, totally forgot to record, but it's this one. Yeah, it's giving. I'm gonna try it on. It's a little bit small by the way. It's way short. Um I grab the small, might as well grab the medium. Like grab your normal normal size. I don't know why I grab the small, but yeah, the your normal size should fit you. So right now it's for me it's a little bit short, but let's look at the back. Look at the back. It's everything right here. You will have to situate it a little bit. I don't have a helping hand at the moment, but y'all, it's a must buy. I love this mesh on their cover leg that it has. Yeah, and it's so long. Imagine me wearing like a heel. <laughs> my hair like high. Oh my god. This is gorgeous. I love it. It's a giving. This one is by the one that I just got at Stratifarious. But this one is from Bershka. And I'm going to go with it. Of course. I ain't gonna leave it here. Mm -mm. It's definitely a buy. Oh, so freaking cute. I can wear this with heels or just with sneakers. High socks. Mm. Okay. I see. I see. I came to slay and I came to slay. <laughs> Party back and all you bitches fuck.